Access your Moodle subject site and find your exam activity. Ignore the Secure Exam Proctor link if you see it and click on your exam activity link. If you do not have Proctorio installed already, you will see this alert. Click on the Click Here link which will take you through the steps to install the Proctorio extension. Click this link. You will be taken to the Chrome Web Store. Click the Add to Chrome button, then click Add Extension. This will add the Proctorio extension to your browser. You can ignore this alert to turn on Sync. You should be taken back to your Moodle site automatically, but if not, you can close these two tabs and reload your Moodle site if it did not do it for you. If you see this alert about a password, you can ignore this. Proctorio will handle this password protection for you automatically. When you are ready to begin, click the Attempt Quiz button. Before your quiz timer begins, Proctorio will do some verification steps. Proctorio will remind you here to disconnect any secondary monitors. You must only have one monitor connected to do your exam. Proctorio will flag any issues here in this yellow alert area. After you have dealt with any critical issues, click Continue. You will now need to grant permission to Chrome to use your camera and microphone. You must click Allow for the camera and for the microphone. Then Proctorio will ask for permission to record your screen. You must click the screen preview on this alert, only then can you click the share button. Be careful not to skip this step and accidentally click cancel. Make sure you do not click the stop sharing button at the bottom of your screen, but you can click the hide link to hide this alert. Do not worry if Proctorio seems to wait here, it is just doing some background processing. Once done, you will see a webcam preview screen. If this is working, click next. You will now need to hold up your student ID to the camera. Proctorio should automatically detect and record it within the green borders. If it cannot automatically detect it after a time, it will ask you to manually capture it. Make sure you can see it, retake it if need be, or click Next. Now click Begin Camera Test. If Proctorio cannot detect your face, it will ask you to retest. Remove any face coverings or check your lighting and retest. If this continually fails, a Proctorio support chat will appear to help you get through this step. You may now begin your exam. This will start the exam timer. When in your exam, you will see these Proctorio quiz tools. If your subject allows it, you may have an option here to use a calculator. If so, this can be opened, moved, or closed as needed. The live chat option is to Proctorio help staff for Proctorio issues. If you require help from UOW staff during your exam, you should use our usual UOW support channels or phone numbers rather than this live chat. These Proctorio quiz tools can be hidden or collapsed if you find them distracting. You may now complete your exam normally. If at some point you are ejected by Proctorio from your exam, you can re-log in to your exam and continue where you left off, but you will need to redo the verification steps to do so. If you need to upload any PDFs or scans of manual working out, you can upload files through the file upload options as needed. Do not use the browser forward and back buttons to navigate your exam. Use the links within the exam activity. When complete, be sure to submit all and finish on your exam as needed. After you have completely finished your exam, if you want to remove Proctorio, you can click the extensions icon, then select the three dots near Proctorio and select Remove from Chrome, then click Remove. Proctorio is now removed from your browser.